Today we're launching the HCMP for the MMP 2.0 Compact. I've been wanting to release a comp for this for a long time. Time is finally here. Let's check it out at the range. HCMP is CNC machined out of 6061 aluminum. We have black anodized options on the website and FDE Cerakote options available as well. Both are great options in protecting the aluminum compensator. The MMP comp comes in at just over an ounce in weight. So it's incredibly light, does not add much to the gun. Coming in at 0.86 inches, so just under 7 eighths of an inch. You can see it's almost flush with the Streamlight TLR1, which is great for concealed carry makes it really easy because this is not a very long setup. This is actually one of the shorter setups that we have. This is one of our easier comps to install. You basically just thread it on until it stops, back it off. Sometimes you have to pull the slide off the frame to get past the recoil assembly, um, and then just tighten down your screws and you're ready to go. We always offer install instructions in the packaging. If you guys have any questions on the install, you can send us an email at support at herringsonarms.com. The only thing you're gonna need for this setup is a threaded barrel. We have the Tribe Defense barrel in here. You can usually get them at Optics Planet. It's actually kind of harder to find a barrel for the Smith & Wesson, um, but that's all you need. We give you everything that you need for installing the compensator. We have the set screws, the Allen key, and you can even pick up the Loctite on our website as well. For the MMP as a carry gun, this is gonna end up as a six out of 10. It's a really nice gun. Uh, it's really short, it's optics ready. The only thing that knocks it down from, let's say, a 7 or an 8 is going to be the grip texture is really aggressive. Other than that, this is a great gun to carry. With the MMP, you're going to have to find an open front holster. It's a lot harder to find closed front holsters for the larger models to get this compensator to work. So if you go on T-Rex's website, they are almost always open front. Um, so you're not going to have any issues picking up a holster for this setup. With the HCMP, we went with a three-port design. This is kind of becoming a flagship for Harrington Arms. It's very effective at reducing felt recoil in the hand and muzzle flip. Uh, as you'll see with the Mantis results, this compensator is very effective. It's very reliable. We did thorough testing and made multiple design changes to make it reliable. It's incredibly short and very effective, so what else can you ask for? If you guys are interested in picking up the HCMP or any of the other comps we released this week, we're going to have the links in the description below. All right, guys, we're going to do a 222 drill with the HCMP on the Smith & Wesson. Let's see how it does. All right, guys, so we got a 775 on that. Now we're gonna do a little bit longer of a drill, longer course of fire. Let's see how it does. All right, guys, we got 794 on that. Let's, uh, let's shoot the Manus for five rounds, see what the record results are. We're looking at about 10 degrees of angular measurement of recoil on this. Pretty typical for a three port design from Harrington Arms. It's about a 35% reduction of felt recoil. This is all typical for one of our compensators and I'm really happy with how it's performing. If you guys are looking to pick up a compensator for your MMP, use code MPYT, all lowercase, at checkout at Harrington Arms. You're gonna get 10% off a compensator. And if you guys really like this video, we'd appreciate a like and subscribe. We'll see you next time.